essential oils class this evening. It's very, very interesting. We're doing essential oil and wine pairing, which is something I've never done before. I don't really drink wine. Um, I drink wine now. We've definitely found a favorite, but I want to show you how we're doing this. So if you're invited to an essential oil and wine pairing class, you know what you're in for because I totally did it. It would totally suit me to do that, or a sippy cup. But um, what I'm doing is I've got the wine. Let's see if we can show you. I learned this this evening, guys. The wine is on the table. I have two fingers on the stem of the glass, and we're just gonna swirl it back and forth, and I've been told that no matter how hard you swirl it, it's not gonna come out. <laughs> I'm glad because I would probably be the one to do it. And then you're going to get your nose in this glass. So just watch and learn and bask in the audience. All right, so Cote de Rhone to me, as I'm learning that I'm more of a sweet wine person versus a dry wine person, it smells earthy. Very, very grapey. It smells very grapey. So what we're going to do is I'm going to take a test and taste it out before I even get cedarwood involved. So I'm going to swirl it around. Let it hang out on your tongue for just a minute. Possibly even inhale as you take a sip. See what that comes at. I don't know, I'm still feeling the sweet wines. All right, so now comes the Young Living Cedarwood. We're not putting this essential oil in the wine. No, 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 no. What we're doing is we're inhaling the essential oil and then we're going to swirl our wine again and breathe in and take a sip to see how the essential oil changes the way our palate interprets the taste of this wine. So this is Young Living Cedarwood. It smells good to me. It smells like an old bench. Mm. And then I'm going to swirl my wine. It made it sweeter, which is really interesting because a lot of people here at the table, there's quite a few people wine tasting this evening. Quite a few people got different interpretations of how the essential oil changed the flavor of the wine. So there you have it. Mm -hmm. 